Do you want to learn how to create epic yet easy text animations? Do you hate After Effects? Great, because in this video, I'm gonna show you how to create 15 text animations in under four minutes. Let's get straight into the video. To get started, just click the first link in the description. Okay, now we're in Veed. We're just going to click upload a file and choose the video that you wanna add your text animation to and just give it a moment here to upload. Now we can choose to resize our video to fit any social media platform. Just head over to size, click the arrow down, and then you can choose from any of the options that you see here. For this video, I wanna make it for YouTube, so I'm going to select that. Now we can add our text. Click text in the toolbar, and you can choose from any of the pre-made options that you see here, or you can click headline title to customize your text and just make it your style. That's what we're gonna do. Click headline title, and then type out your text. Now we can choose our font. We can choose our text size, the color, and then click effects, and you can choose your favorite in here. And then all you have to do is position your text on screen and we're ready to animate it. So to animate your text, just click on animation. In here, we have 15 different styles of text animations that you can choose from. And to test them out, it's very simple. Just hover your mouse over each one and you'll see it in effect. Now choose your favorite, then head to your timeline and you can extend the length of time that that text stays on screen by just increasing the length of that text bar. I'm gonna play it back now so you can see it in action. Perfect. We're now gonna move our playhead over in the timeline and add our next piece of text that we want to animate. So I'm gonna move it slightly over, then just click on your video and just repeat the same steps again. So then click text in the toolbar, click headline title, type out your text, choose your font. You can opt for a different font this time if you like, the choice is yours. And then all we're going to do is choose our color, the effect. This time I'm gonna opt for a different animation. I'm gonna reposition it on screen. And then again, I'm just gonna drag that over in my timeline to extend the length of time it will stay on screen. And we're gonna do this all over again for our final piece of animated text. Just click on the video, click text, then headline title, type in your text, choose your font, your size, the color, effect, and then animation. And I'm just gonna place it on screen and then all I'm gonna do for the last time, drag that text bar over in the timeline. And you can just keep repeating this process if you wanna add more pieces of animated text. Now, there's one final step that I wanna show you and it's sound effects. It's gonna take your text animation from here to here. So let me show you how to do that. It's very, very easy. Just move your playhead over to the very start of your video, then click on audio in the toolbar. And then beside stock audio, it says search, click on that. And here you can type in any sound effect that you like, but I've actually chosen text that slides in place so I'm going to use the whoosh sound effect so just type in whoosh and then I'm going to select the third option you see here and it's going to load in my timeline now if you can't see it in your timeline use the sidebar over here scroll it down and it should be visible now we're just going to push it over in the timeline to make more room for the next sound effect Put your playhead at the beginning of the next text layer. Click on the sound effect again, and it's going to load. And again, we're just gonna push that over to make room for the very last sound effect. The last text animation I used is called bounce. So I'm gonna use a different sound effect for this one. I'm gonna search for pop, and then I'm gonna select the very first option here. And now that's loaded, we can download our video. So just click export in the top right-hand corner, choose your render settings, and click export once more. Now give that a moment here to render. Once it's finished, watch it all the way through just once, just to make sure you're happy with it. And if you're happy with it, you can go ahead and click download and download MP4. And that's it. That's how to use our 15 different text animations. I really hope you found this video helpful. Guys, if you want to learn how to animate your subtitles, I will pop a video for this now on screen. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.